Agro Suede and welcome everyone to Agro Suede Back Your Garden with me, Mitchell Juno Suede. Well, guess what, guys? We are not in the Back Your Garden. I do apologize in a future announcement, I'll let you know why. Um, but in the meantime, what I decided to do, I decided um, that I would go shopping. And <laughs> I came across some massive peppers which I have not seen ever, ever in my life. I've never seen peppers as big as this. This is treating like my whole palm. So what I decided in this video, I'm just going to um, sort of somehow introduce you to these peppers which I came across and also do some testing. I'm not testing, sorry, tasting. And I did sow some seeds. Um, I had an orange one I bought um, so that I could prepare some meal and I did sow the seeds and the seeds are germinating. So I will show you the seeds pretty soon. Nonetheless, I'm just going to go ahead and um, possibly cut and open these sweet peppers and taste it so that you guys could um you know so i could tell you guys about it let's go ahead now the thing is that all the peppers are actually sweet peppers um the only pepper that may be different this is is this one it's a uh, cubana leo uh, like pink on the shelf i saw it my cubana leo all of these are bell peppers apparently uh, that is me yo okay so we are gonna go first with the unique one which i've never seen before I did went ahead and I washed it. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut it like this. So let's see what it looks like on the inside. And I will try to sow the seeds. Oh, wow. Okay, so here it is, we've got this pepper. Okay, so it's pretty much similar to all the regular pepper, except um, it's much longer. I thought um, the seeds would have gone all the way up or along the entire length of the pepper, but no, it's literally only at the base of the pepper right here. I'm gonna do a test, taste test, sorry. Um, apparently this wheel is supposed to get yellow. As you can see, it's, it was already turning yellow as it's ripe. So as it's green, it's not ripe as yet. Nonetheless, I'm still gonna go ahead and um, first I want to save the seeds. So I'm just going to have the seeds cut off. There's a lot on the shelf at the store, believe me. So if I don't happen to save the seeds, I can easily go and buy another one. Um, how much this cost? I think this this one cost like 99 cents or 96 cents, I believe. It was per pong, and because I literally bought one of each, it did not come to the real value. Nonetheless, I'm going to taste it to see. I'm not sure if it's a hot pepper. I don't think it is. I researched it. It's not a hot pepper. If anything, it's almost tasteless. It smells like watermelon, actually. Not sure. It's virtually tasteless. Okay. So let's go to the next one. Um, I'm gonna do the I'm gonna have this one done for you guys right now because life is too short. Anything can happen between now and then. So let me go ahead and taste and enjoy this one. Okay, so this is a bell pepper, guys. No way. Guys, have you ever grown a pepper this big? Mercy. Look at the stalk. Almost like my nail. Comparison to my fingernail, it's huge. Okay, we're gonna cut it now. Um, I'm not quite sure if the seeds are going all the way up here, so let's see. That is just massive. Okay, here we go. Mm, let me swallow what I'm eating right now. Okay, so here we go. See this? Here is it. Oh my god. Yo. I thought this is we're gonna go all the way up. With this one, it kind of looked like it was gonna do it. Look closely. As you can see, we've got seeds here along here. But this is the main area where the seeds have been stored in the fruit. And this is a... Oh my! We've got a situation of a pepper in a pepper. Right here. Allow me to cut it up for you guys to see. I don't think these are naturally grown. I really don't think they are like organically and naturally grown. Um, honestly, I'll tell you. I don't think they are. But still, I decided to just do it for you guys to see. Uh, look here. I feel like this is this is a side effect. Um, I was growing peppers naturally and it happened too. So I don't think it's to do with chemical or anything like that. But I think this is a side effect of being a hybrid pepper. Um, as you can see here. So I don't think it's anything to do with chemical. Um, nonetheless, not a lot of seeds on this one. Not a lot at all. 
but we're still gonna do the testing let's taste and see mm. this one tastes like guava this one is sweet mm. it really does taste like guava mm. you could almost have this as a snack only thing I'm really not sure this is organically grown. This looks like it's, it's I, I've never seen a pepper that big in my life. It's almost unnatural. So if you guys have had or grown big peppers like this, let me know in the comment section. This is from an American um, store I bought it. So, yes, so I'm not quite sure if it's organically grown. Nonetheless, it tastes like guava. It's a bit sweeter, of course. And it was a bell pepper. Now this is the orange one. Okay, here we go. This one is more of a round pepper, of course, as you can see. Okay, so this one. It, it, it brings back memory of a, other fruit. I'm not quite sure. They smell like different fruits. Okay, we're gonna test it to see. Oh gosh, it's... this one have more pepper seeds. We'll compare the pepper seeds after the quantity. Um, okay, let's go ahead and do a test test. This one tastes something like watercress actually. Sweet, but it tastes a bit like watercress. Oh, the battery's dying. We may not even have time to eat all. Hmm. Sorry guys, the battery is dying. So I have to move quick now. It's on 5%. I was using the camcorder for oh my earlier. The orange one tastes a bit like watercress. Let's see. This one has a lot more moisture in it. It's thicker. Hmm. Yep. The yellow one have a lot of moisture. And they are all bell peppers, by the way. Now this one is just a green bell pepper. Not sure if it's the red, orange, or yellow, but it's green. It's not ripe as yet. Okay. Let's see. Ah. Ah. Of course, it's not ripe. Ah. This horrible. Ah. Ah. I don't like that one. Uh -uh. So, so far, guys, the best one. Is the yellow the sweetest one is the red yeah this one is sweet that's the sweetest rich in moisture and water obviously green is a fail um orange i'm not quite sure what i think of the orange orange one is tougher and of course, the long one, blem, quite blem. Okay guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video um, that I did. Oh, this is some seasoning, some plants that's been growing in the pot. I will have to do another video to show you what's going on in there. And possibly I might have to sow the seeds, not sure as yet. Thank you so very much for subscribing. Of course, I go to Backyard Garden. Remember, guys, a Backyard Garden in some ways will keep the doctors away. And Agus Wade is out.